The Spurs at the top of their game in that first half. Yeah, they were great offensively, Marv. They really developed a nice groove. I thought the ball movement was good. The spacing was there. So they've got to continue to get those offensive sets going smoothly here in the third quarter. The ball is knocked loose. Blair looking for the ball. Pass to Leonard. Shot clock at seven. Delivery to Leonard. And he hits it. Boy, that was great execution on that set right there, Marvin. They've been doing it all night. That's how they've built this lead. Really, really sound offense. The pass to Wade. Chalmers looking for the open man. Yes! James is two for eight from the field. Good solid pick there. Frees him up for the jump shot. Now the offensive foul will give it back to the Heat. Oh, that was a good call. I, I didn't think there was any question about it. I don't know what play you were looking at. That, that was obviously a block, and yet he gets called for the charge. Wade wants the ball. Here comes the screen. He's sizing up his man. Wade creates space, stepping back. And that is his first field goal. Pass to Ginobili. Duncan setting up on the low block. And a foul is called. Blair looking to get open. The Spurs keep the possession going. Another defensive stop. You can feel the momentum changing a little bit here, Mark. Bosch trying to break through. Delivery to James. Bosch looking to shake free. Ball's knocked out of his hands. And Manu Ginobili called for the foul. That's his first. And Dwayne Wade at the line. Misses them both. Ginobili walking it up. And DeWan Blair with an offensive foul. Tim Duncan's had a sensational game tonight. Well, he's got it rolling here tonight, Marv, playing with so much confidence, bringing out all the offensive skills. I don't know if anybody can stop him tonight. Chalmers to the front court. The pass to Wade. And he's rejected. Two and a half minutes remaining in the third quarter. Spurs up by four. Ginobili using the screen. Shot clock to four. And Dwayne Blair not able to hit. And the bucket. Oh, they've been really effective offensively tonight, Marv. That's one of the reasons they're winning this game. They've found a nice rhythm. They're getting open looks, and they're really sharing the ball. Oh, he loses it. Leonard comes up with the steal. And Udonis has one called for the foul. That's his second. At the line, it's been a terrific night at the free throw line. And hits both. Chalmers in possession. Pass to Wade. Field goal. 
Delivery to Ginobili. Going off the dribble. James with the block. So that puts Miami over the line. Leonard at the line. He has been outstanding to this point. A minute and a half remaining in the third. Spurs up by six. Wade trying to get free off the pick. Swat him away. Wade trying to get free off the pick. Looks like he's trying to size it up here off the dribble. Five on the 24. And rebounded by Duncan. Very poor offensive execution, Marvin. They end up with a terrible shot. Blair looking to get open. And Tim Duncan not able to hit. Well, absolutely terrific defense, challenging the shot. And this is what you have to do when you've fallen behind and you're trying to get back into a ball game. The pass to Ginobili. Blair trying to free himself up. Half minute remaining in the third. Spurs up by seven. Five second differential between the game clock and the shot clock. Pass to James. Ginobili able to hustle it down. The Heat are over at the foul line. And Dewan Blair to the line. He comes back to hit the second after missing that first free throw. Chalmers with a quick release. Final seconds, and he'll just fire one up. So after three, the Spurs lead by eight. as we head to the fourth quarter the home crowd has to be pleased what they have seen to this point well i think so marv their team has played very well at least through the first three quarters but you know, they've got to be careful in this fourth quarter they've got to continue to take care of the basketball and execute offensively if they're going to maintain this lead